Yeah, Brandon, you have been in a couple of these games. You've ended up on both sides <laughs> of it, unfortunately. Yeah. I'm sorry about that. It's, it's um, but the preparation is the same. Can you kind of just walk me through what these players are going through right now in this next week leading up? To the big game. Well, first of all, they have to manage pressure, you know, because look, the weight of this game is heavy. So what they need to do is just act like it's another football game. And I think that's what helped us on the second big game because we were able to say, you know what, it's just another game. We're going to go out here. We're going to do our thing as we've done all season. Also, you know, what helped us when it came to, you know, game planning or, or getting our mind ready, managing stress, you know, different things like that. We, you know, keep to lead, brought the defense together. And he said, look, guys, Look what Carolina has has faced. Look look what they've gone against. No defense has been like our defense. So that gave us a little confidence. And when we went to the game, we, we showed everybody. Now, what do you think the biggest key is to staying focused and being locked in to the game in front of you? You know, look, <laughs> the week of the big game is, is, is huge, right? There's a lot of events going on. There's a lot of things. And initially, you know, a team doesn't have curfew. So... Our first big uh -oh. game, we didn't have curfew, so, you know, we were out in the city, in New York City, we were doing too much. TMZ caught us, uh, and they made an article about what we were doing in the city. So, the media. Exactly. So what we needed to do was just, okay, instead of worrying about having a good time and, um, you know, attending all the festivities that week, just focus up, lock in. And that's what we did the second big game, which is why the outcome was... <laughs> Right, completely different. Right, it was yeah. night and day there. Now, also staying healthy. Health is so important right now, especially yeah. for a guy like Patrick Mahomes. How important is that to really make sure that not only physically you're yeah. you're doing okay, but mentally too, getting that sleep and eating right and all, everything that it takes. Yeah, I mean, look, everything because look, you know, Patrick Mahomes, he is the guy, right? He is somebody that mm -hmm. you know everybody's looking to, and he can either you know obviously you know break the game or make the game. So you know, with his ankle sprain, his high ankle sprain, and it's it's funny because I had a high angle sprain going into uh, the uh, big game that when I played, uh, you know, the second time as well. So it was tough. I was still, you know, my you know ankle injury was lingering for a while. So I believe Patrick Mahomes will be lingering for a little bit, but I'm sure he's doing everything he needs to do, all the treatment, getting all the massage that he needs, and hopefully, right, we'll see a different Patrick Mahomes. He'll be able to move in and out the pocket uh, against that that elite Eagles front.